Hello everyone, it's Naomi, and I wanted to show you um, some little spirit dolls that I create. And I'm showing you this today because they're very powerful. And what I do is I make them out of wax and they don't have to be fancy. What, it's, what you use them for is you put your intentions into them. And like for instance, I made this little owl today. And he's made out of wax. And when I made him, I put them in like a little jar like this. I put a candle melt wax in it. And then I add in herbs or for him I put, for these I put lavender in there and different um, herbs um, to help with the powers that I want them to have. And so the owl, of course, is knowledge, but I use him for spiritual knowledge and to have um, psychic abilities, increased psychic abilities. And I also put um, the green stone in there for, you know, heart, seen from the heart. And I like to put gold. I put, uh, take a gold pen and put gold on them so they bring in good energy vibration always putting in good energy into them and this one I used today was very powerful it was made, created to the goddess Bast the Egyptian cat goddess and the Egyptian cat goddess Bast is uh, green is her color so I put green in there and I put some charms and some stones that I want her to have that energy um, I put the turquoise stone in the middle and then some other stones around it for the heart and I put a stone with the name of Bast on it and this little charm all the charms that I put into them I have imbued energy onto those charms too in sort of a, a spell cast and so these charms have been charged with certain energies that I want this little spirit doll to have and then when I do my enchantments I use the, the pendulum and I use incense and candles and it's basically praying upon you know the the spirit doll the energy that I want in there so I imbue that with the spirit of the doll and then I use the doll when I'm doing an enchantment with the pendulum and so I do the incense and I do the you know it's attracting on what's this when it's spinning in a clockwise motion I'm attracting attracting things I want in that enchantment and everything in the plate that I have is going to be imbued with this energy and also it, it creates this sort of magical enchantment and so when you use these stones and charms and the little dolls to work with you um, I use them in meditations also to focus your energy on what you want to manifest in your life. This is another thing I make little bottles of elixirs I call them and they're just different herbs and you know things that I put in there to uh, draw the energy that I want. This one is what's under here. This one is an abundance jar so if I wanted more abundance in my life, abundance of love, abundance of money, you would, I would take, you know, a little bit of this, this elixir and, you know, put it on the candle that I'm using, and I also rub them on the, on the spirit dolls. So I just wanted to tell you a little bit about, you know, how I create these enchantments, and you can create them too. I also make these little stones. You can buy them in a craft store and I paint them with the words that you want to bring into your life. Joy. You know, this today I use Ra, which is uh, 
Bas is the daughter of Ra, the sun god. So, you know, I, I paint little stones with, you know, meanings on them, symbols, words. And I also do, you know, energy uh, enchantments on them too. And I use the, of course, the crystals to help me as well. And certain stones I use that help uh, bring in certain energies when I'm doing enchantments. So I just figured you'd, you might be interested in knowing how I do these uh, enchantments. Uh, I forgot to tell you about him. He's a shell and I put wax on him and I kind of made him in a shape of a man. He's the, it doesn't look like much, but it's, to me, it represents the Hierophant in uh, tarot. He's holding the golden, like a torch, and he's um, a wise man. So more like to with the, the owl, you know, gaining wisdom, insight. So I will use him in an enchantment. And Bast was very powerful today. You know, I made this this morning, and then I was making the enchantment, and I figured I'd put I'd put it to music. So I thought oh, I'll use uh, Stevie Nicks music. You know, she's a practicing witch, and I figured that would be good energy for it. And I had her music playing as I was doing the enchantment, and then when I uploaded the video, it was this slowed down video with this terrible sound in the back like a lion, you know, about to, you know, pounce on prey, and my enchantment was for attraction energy, so I was using Bast because she's a sensual goddess and attracts you know, love and, you know, abundance and things like that. So I thought that was really wild. When I replayed the video, it, it came up like this lion, like she had taken over the video. And it kind of freaked me out. It was a little bit scary, but I was told by spirit, it's the spirit of Bast coming through. And it really sounded like it. So... I thought it was very interesting and I hope you are enjoying these videos and I would like to ask the people in the community to please post um, the things you like, um, spiritual things that you want to know, um, that you do, practices. It's a community. You can share. You know, I don't have to be the only one sharing and I want to thank you those of you that have been sharing, I really appreciate it. So I hope more of you will come forward and start sharing your wisdom in the community. And I hope you all have a wonderful day. I love you guys, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.